Ontario was six degrees when people started arriving at three o'clock this morning. Last minute adjustments are meticulously carried out because at speeds of 90 miles an hour or more, this is a race between machines as well as men and danger seems to come with the territory. The tracks they ride on, they're honed to a razor's edge and the studs as sharp as the point of a pin. There's a saying among these racers, when I get out there, I put the hammer down and pray. It takes guts and determination to put these machines on the starting line. And though most of these men have had to drive all night just to get here, the feeling of that power and that thrill of competition washes away all the weariness. Of course, there are some who wash it away differently. <laughs> it's 15 laps around this half mile track, and just to finish is a victory in itself. Snowmobiles are designed primarily for left-hand turns with extended outside runners and short inside handlebars. But riding inches above the ground sometimes isn't enough to stabilize them and accidents still occur. Amazingly enough, on the day we were filming, aside from a lot of sore bruises, no one was badly injured. Although we weren't too sure who won this particular heat, we were sure who brought up the rear. Generally, we give trophies away for gentlemen going around the track on their snowmobiles, but this here particular trophy is for a chap that went through the fence, and this is what's left of the fence. <laughs> 